Premiere Pro's new AI feature text best editing has changed the game. Now you can effortlessly create a rough cut by just copying and pasting text much like you would in a Word document. Instead of sifting through hours of interview footage for the right sound bites, you can simply use automatically generated transcript and edit the text to build your sequence. Isn't that amazing? Additionally, new enhanced speech feature allows you to remove background noise from your audio with just one click. Hello, I'm Sanketa and welcome to my YouTube channel Vertical Dots. Let's explore Premiere Pro's new AI features. If you want to edit this interview footage, you can skip the listening part and head straight to the text panel. If you don't see the text panel, go to the window and click on text. You will find the transcribe source option. Click on transcribe. A window will pop up where you can select your preferred language. If there's more than one speaker, you can label them separately. I'll choose no two separate speakers and click on transcribe. It will take a few seconds to create an auto transcription. And it's done. You'll notice these three dots. They represent pauses in the video. Now let's create rough cuts. Simply select the text you want to add to the timeline and press the comma key on your keyboard. This action will add that part of the video to the timeline. Now click on the source window because we need the source videos transcript. Click on text and select the text you want to add next. If you decide that you don't want a particular sentence in the video, you can select that text and press the delete button on your keyboard. It will automatically update the timeline. Moreover, if you want to move a part of the video to the beginning, select that text, right click, choose cut or use the keyboard shortcut. Then go to the beginning of the video, right click and select paste. You will see the clip move to the beginning of the video. Now let me show you another fantastic feature. Click on this icon and choose filler words. It will highlight all the filler words in the video which you can delete with one click. This feature will save you a significant amount of time during editing. Anyone who edits interview footage knows the pain of removing a uh and um from speech, right? This new text-based editing feature gives you the feeling that you are making changes in a Word document, but in reality, you are editing a video. Huh. Another powerful addition is enhanced speech. Listen to this clip. Panic when someone comes with a huge, massive issue. It's easy for you to stay calm and listen and try to help the person. And for you individually, I'd like to add to that. Um, it helps us like to resolve with our traumatic experience and then to get to the roots of the problem, not just to know what happened. It was recorded outdoors, so there's a lot of background noise bearing the speaker's voice. Now you can fix it with just one click. Right click on that clip and look for enable enhanced page. Click on it and that's it. Look at the result. When someone comes with a huge, massive issue, it will be easy for you to stay calm and listen and try to help the person. And so you individually, I think it's awesome. I'd like to add to that. Um, it helps us like to resolve with our traumatic experience and then to get to the roots of the problem. It instantly removes the background noise and enhances the voice quality. You can make further adjustments in the essential sound panel. 
and when someone comes up with a huge massive issue where it'll be easy for you to stay calm and listen and try to help the person and for you individually I think it's awesome I'd like to add to that um, it helps us like to resolve with our traumatic experience and then to get to the leaves of the problem not just to know what happened but what also caused this to happen God is it's good better understanding both of these AI features are significant additions to Premiere Pro and will save us a ton of time during editing. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it and found it helpful, then please show your support by hitting the like button, subscribing to the channel and sharing your thoughts in the comments below. I have more video editing tutorials on my channel that you can follow. Bye for now. I'll see you next time.